think about when he finally decides to leave, why didn't he leave the fourth? Okay, why didn't he leave the first, second, third, fourth, fifth, tenth, and the fifth, 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 what is the person who is going to be when he leaves and if the kids get sick or if he gets sick? He's too worried about the credit card bill that he probably can do if he gets sick. Or whether the kids get sick in the way. Because he can't afford that at home. He can go and help her with these things. And that's why he will be delayed. That's why she'll then be able to buy um, the social care for your children. Um, and you're just quite comfortable having that for those reasons that you do it. Even though you're
Ms. Kuzma, you mentioned uh, some statistical analysis of how helpful an attorney could be. I, uh, and I heard, the, I saw a statistic a while ago that showed it was uh, many more times uh, more likely to get a protective order. I, I don't know if you have the latest statistic. If you have an attorney versus not having an attorney, do you know the, the numbers there? Just uh, you know, protective orders are good. Um, but certainly, uh, the level of violence that escalates it may not necessarily stop the person who still having contact with uh, the victim. So I'm wondering if there's maybe some sort of like escalating penalty or whatnot if the protective order is violated, and how you would go about handling.